Say it ain't so, say it ain't so. Diddy been taken to federal custody, child, for them ex-allegations. Ooh, wee! Took him long enough. But, um, ooh, yeah, Diddy finally gonna slam a child. It is sticky, too. You know it's gonna stick, right? Because he's been avoided for so long, and, like, everything is cool, calm, and collective, but baby, they've been watching it like a Hulk, honey. And this is what your behind gets. Shout out to Cassie for exposing this man, and shout out to Kim Porter from the grave for putting this man behind bars. Let's get into what the lawyer said. The lawyer said, we are disappointed with the decision to pursue what we believe is an unjust prosecution of Mr. Combs by the U.S. Attorney's Office. Sean Diddy Combs is a music icon, celebrating entrepreneur, loving family man, and proven philanthropist, which is crazy as fuck, who has spent the last 30 years building an empire during his children and working to uplift the black community. Uplift the black community where? Because did he uplift anything more than his pockets and putting men in the grave and stealing artists' money and scaring people? Oh, okay. So with that being said, let this white man give y'all more tea because, baby, <laughs> this is a mess. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Peace. Holy shit, y'all, this is effing mammoth. Sean Diddy Combs was just taken into federal custody in New York following a grand jury indictment. Now, what we do know is that he was taken to the FBI field office in Manhattan and that this is in connection to the criminal investigation regarding S trafficking and other offenses, which led to the bi-coastal raids on his home through Homeland Security and law enforcement. Now, here are the things that are really important to know about this. This indictment is coming out of the Southern District Court of New York. These guys have like a 95 or 97% conviction rate. On top of that, when the FBI gets involved, they don't arrest you until they have a very solid case, and they too are 95 to 97% conviction, meaning that very likely he's going to be serving federal time. Now, at this moment in time, this is still a developing story. There's still a lot more information that's going to come out, um, so I will keep you guys updated, so definitely hit that follow button if you're interested. But... We have been wanting him to go down for such a long time. This is absolutely incredible. Drop your thoughts in the comments. Lock his ass up. Lock his ass up. You going to jail. You going to jail. My problem. That's just my problem.